fish and chips, fish and chips. I'm gonna make it out of these bacalitos, okay? Make like a little batter and we'll get these guys all cooked up, all right? So I'm eating today. Hey, but check this out. It is storming outside. You can see it from over there. Look at that. Came out of nowhere. Goodness. Big guy, big guy. What's up? They gon' feel us when we roll. They call them big guy, big guy. Okay. And we be putting on for sure. And if you know these, join this. Subscribe to the channel. We like the video. It's a big family. And we putting on big for the team. Oh, big guy, big guy. What's up? this fish real quick show you guys what i'm eating today and we gonna go now pray you guys are doing well and uh let's get into the video all right guys we're going to um, season the fish i know chocolate is not that good for you i'm gonna go ahead and fix what i got eat it on up and then i'm gonna if you guys give me in the comments a suggestion of a, another type of fish that's better to eat i'm thinking whiting or a flounder or something Let's see. This is Swahi Swahi. So I got that uh, with the Obey. I'm gonna uh, season up my fries here. Bring your hands, go ahead and mix these guys around. Make sure your, your seasoning is where it needs to be. All right, I think we're good. I think we're good. my fish. So this is a fresh, uh, <laughs> a fresh, it's a bitter, it's a fish fritter mix. So basically you can make these by themselves. And uh, you eat them and have uh, like a cod type flavor. But what I'm going to do is use this as a, a batter for my fish. It's really good. It gives you really good seasoning. I'm going to put this guy in here. And some agua. About a cup. Let's put a half a cup in first. I'm going to stir it. Until it gets the consistency that I like. Let me get to stirring this guy and I'll be right back. Alright guys, check out my batter. Look at that. I went ahead and I added more flour to it. And I'm gonna taste it and see. Um, mmm, it tastes really good. Oh, so I don't need any more seasoning, so it tastes really good. So, all right. Next step is to dip these guys inside there and we're gonna put them in the pot. All right, guys, with a clean hand, you're gonna take your fish and put it over in your batter. Put it over in your batter. Just like that. And then you're going to take your little spoon and you're going to stir these guys up in there. Make sure they're all covered. You can do this with one hand, but you get the gist. Let me go ahead and get this finished and I'm going to go ahead and drop the fish. All right, guys, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Look at that. This stuff is ready. This oil is ready. So I'm just going to take a fork, take it out of here. I mean, you can't see this, but I'm going to bring it over here. Take a fork and take it out of here. See it? And we're gonna drop it. That's simple. And drop it. See, we got it. Got one more. There we go. All right, guys. See the fish cooking here? 
let it cook until um, it becomes brown. I think it's about, about five or six minutes. It should be fine. They're, they're not big pieces. You see a little, a little crackling, like uh, long John Sivers and uh, Captain Bees? That's gonna be good too. It's a very easy meal. Very, very easy meal. And it's quick. As long as it takes to fry it, you're good. Yeah, here we go. Look at that. This took about six to eight minutes for this fish. But look how beautiful it is. Look at that. Yeah. I'm going to go ahead and take these guys out of here. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Get a good pan. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm going to cook fish um, the way again. I like the batter. I like the batter look. Look at the batter look. Okay. And a little crisp on the bottom down there. Mm -hmm. Like Long John Silver's, baby. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. We're going to get the rest of them done, I mean cooked, and then we go ahead and start the potatoes. Potatoes in my batter. So I'm going to do the potatoes two ways. I'm going to batter some, and I'm just going to dust the others. But look at the fish. Almost done with the fish. Look at that color, man. You cannot beat that color. And they're good, too. I already tasted it. <laughs> All right. Dropping the batter. Chip, too. Look at that. Look at that. All right, let's let them fry and see what's going on. I'm about to pull these fish out, too. Look at that. are almost ready. They're almost ready. We like coating the batter. And uh, man, they turned out looking really great. I wish I would have seasoned them a little bit more, but I'm, I'm going to go ahead and I'm gonna throw a dust of seasoning on it once they come out of the oil. Yeah, that looks good. The fish, the fish is okay chilling. Wait to be eaten. Look at that. Fish and chips, big guy style. That's it. Okay, I gotta have my hot sauce, some mustard, a little french fry season, and a little toddy sauce. Look at that. Yeah, that's it, man. That's the move. That's it. Mm-hmm. Look at this fish. I'm break this fish open. Break it open. That's how it looks on the inside. That's it. That's how flaky it is. Now let me taste it. Mm-hmm. Man, this is good. Come on, one more piece. Hold up. One piece. Look at that. See it? Inside of it. Mmm. Mmm, 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 mmm. Look at him. I'm gonna stop breathing. Whew. Look at that fish, though. Look at that fish. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Really good, really good. So I got my secret. Only drawback is fried fish. <laughs> it's a little oily, but it's not wrong with cheat day. It's not wrong with having a cheat time. So enjoy yourself. It's your boy, it's your boy. <sighs> I pray you guys are doing well. This video is over. I'll see you guys next time. God bless. Oh, and happy Father's Day to all the fathers out there. Peace.